What is going on YouTube and welcome back to the JDW Sports Talk Show where every fan is welcome. Should the Indianapolis Colts draft Sky Moore at 42? If you enjoy Colts content and NFL content, make sure you like, subscribe, and put that post notification bell on so you want to see any future videos. And let's get right into the video. So, Chris Ballard and the Colts love this kid. They have talked to Sky Moore a ton. They even had workouts with him as well, visiting his pro day too. I can't tell you how much this Colts front office, how much this Colts team loves this kid. They love the dude. They love his work ethic. They love what he's about. They love his route running, his hands, his his you know, his tangibles, not just, you know, his physical traits, but his mental traits and and the kid that he is, you know, his personality. They really like this kid. And he has the making to be one of the best wide receivers in this draft. He he has reserve draft boards for a reason. He's fast. He has elite speed. He's strong for his size. You know, he's five foot ten, like one hundred and ninety-five pounds, but he is strong. He is strong. So what you need to know, Skymore's ceiling is as high as any receiver in this draft. I have co full confidence in saying that. His route running is a little raw. When it comes to intermediate, intermediate and that and the deep route running, but it's really not bad at all. It's really not that bad, but it does need some work. And he is from a smaller school, but he is so athletic, athletically gifted, smart, and talented. He will translate just fine when you work hard, when you have a good mindset, when you're smart and you're talented. You're a good route runner. You you know you catch the ball. Good release. Usually those guys translate pretty damn well to the NFL. So, one of the reasons the Colts need to really jump on him or even try it up for him. So, some of his strengths and weaknesses. So, first you look at his strengths. His agility is off the walls. His agility is, you know, you you put him in a room with some of these receivers and, and, and this guy, we, you... You would be fully confident to win a game of tag with all these wide receivers, all these other wide receivers, and for how shifty all those, you know, all these other wide receivers are, how good all these other guys are. It's telling you some. Sky Moore is incredibly has so much agility. It's not even funny. He is wildly gifted. Speed, four four one speed. He is pretty damn fast. It's elite speed, and with that comes a strength. He is 5'10", 195, but goodness gracious, he is strong. Solid hands. You know, he doesn't drop much. He has pretty consistent, solid hands, which is nice, you know. Colts have a hard time finding those receivers with solid hands. A lot of receivers have, you know, inconsistencies, inconsistencies in catching the ball. So, you know, they're just not what you want them to be as, as NFL wide receivers. And the, re and the release is up there with the best. You know, you go back and you watch the Michigan game, game and you watch a Pittsburgh game, which is a better competition. He had no problem getting off the line. He had no problem beating those cornerbacks. And, though, and that competition is obviously much better than the other competition that he played. And that's one of the weaknesses that we're going to start with. Even though it's on the bottom, you know, it kind of makes sense to start there since we're talking about it. So competition, you know, it's one of the big things you got to, Watch out, but his skill set and his work ethic and how he goes about everything, he's he's uh he's exactly how a wide receiver should should translate to the NFL. He will translate just fine. So he need as I as I already mentioned, he needs to refine intermediate or deep route running, but it's really not that bad. But having a guy like Matt Ryan, a vet like Matt Ryan, having a wide receiver coach like Reggie Wayne, definitely gonna help with that. His catch radius is not the greatest. So if a ball is a little off target, if a ball is, you know, not placed right, you know, he's going for contested catches. Gonna, you know, it's gonna make it a little difficult for his size as well. But he can go up and attempt to go for or for a contested catch, and he will do okay. But he's just not a contested catch guy like that. So so watch out there. And then his size that relates to his size a little bit. He, you know, as I said before, he's five foot ten, one ninety five, but He's strong, and, you know, his strength, his size shouldn't be what they are. You know, his strength, he's so strong, and 
that's and that's big time for a wide receiver because you know you want your wide receiver to be able to get off them. You, you want your wide receiver to be able to be a little bit physical, and Sky Moore can do just that. So more on Sky Moore. Sky Moore is an amazing option at number at the forty two spot. You know they may need to trade up for him. They may need to trade up. You know he has rose big time on draft boards. Ever since his combine, he's he's really just you know his draft stock just shot up, and rightfully so. The route running, the 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 mental ability, the physical ability, the agility, the speed. He's smart. Route running, catching. He's a kid that's everyone's gonna want him because he's you know for all the reasons I just mentioned. Don't forget, Matt Ryan's leadership and veteran presence will help Sky more develop. And, and oh, don't forget, Reggie Wayne is a wide receiver coach. I already mentioned both of these, but, you know, some pretty damn good up, you know, some damn good signs, some things that really help him out that could really boost his ceiling even more, could boost his development, make it faster, make him be better much, fat, you know, much quicker. Sky is the limit for this kid. Pun is intended. Pun is intended. Sky more, you know, the sky's the limit. You know, th this kid's going to come in the foul and he's going to, and he's going to tear it up. He's going to tear it up. As long as he stays healthy, as long as he keeps working hard, he's going to tear it up. He's going to be a very good wide receiver in, this, in, in the NFL for years to come, whether it's, whether it's with the Colts or not. So, you know, the Colts may need to trade up for him. And, you know, I did make a video on the Colts having to trade up for maybe Sky Moore or some other wide receivers, but go check that out if you like. But that's going to be for this video. So, I mean, so I appreciate you tuning in to the JW Sports Talk Show, giving me a chance, giving me a shot, listening to the video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, subscribe, put that post notification bell on so you miss any future videos. That's going to be it for, this, for today. Hope you've enjoyed, and you have a good one. I'll catch you later. This is JD to the W Sports Talk Show, signing off.